Well, I'm back with another 3.3 .3 GDI motor. This time, all bolts fell out of the intake cam. Those two valves are wide open. So that head is pretty much junk. But I just did a new motor in a Kia. It had the 3.3 .3 in it. And the bottom end seized up. But it had good heads on it. So I'm going to take those heads, at least one of them, and put them on this Hyundai. Hopefully that's all she needs. We'll see. All right, so we got the head out. Somebody's actually done this head before. You can see the Scotch Bright whiz wheel marks on there. But those are the two bent valves. Oh, those are trash. Just put a little mark on the piston. I think that'll be fine. It's not too bad. But uh, those pistons actually relatively clean. So, yeah, I'll we'll clean that up. And uh, stick this other head on there. And then get her back together. Alright, so we got the heads back on. We got the uh, timing chains all timed. And I'm just cleaning off the timing chain cover, sealing surfaces. But uh, yeah, it went we'll back together pretty good. Start putting everything else back together, and we'll see how it runs. Main thing is that the uh, cylinder head bolts held. They're known to strip out, it's aluminum block. Got crazy torque specs on these. You torque them to 30 foot pounds, then 122 degrees, and then an additional 90 degrees. So it's got some torque on them. Those all held, so we're good to go. All right, so we got the uh one day up and running, but the uh, four-wheel drive isn't working, but uh, runs and drives, so that'll be a, another video fixing that four-by, but yeah, as far as the motor goes, it uh, works pretty good, so accomplished that, should be a nice new rig.